Hi everybody, it's Sheila. Welcome back to the Crocheters channel. Today what we're going to do is we're going to open our September 2021 Mary Maxim Crochet Kit of the Month. I know it's October, but they've changed their scheduling over at Mary Maxim. It looks like what they're doing now is they're billing us in the middle of the month because that's what happens with me in the last two months now they're billing in the middle of the month and they're shipping out the product at the end of the month whereas they used to ship it out at the beginning of the first week of the month now they're doing it differently and it's been consistent for the last two months that this is the way they're doing it so i'm thinking this is what they're going to be doing from moving forward so at least we're going to be on a better schedule i hope so it looks like at the end of the month they're shipping out for that month so even though we're october this is going to be september of 2021 okay but as we've done in the months past um, i'll continue to go back to the month before and show you what i've done with that show you what what the make was those kinds of things so let's jump back i know it seems odd now to august 2021 i'm gonna set this aside for a second and remind you what we got there we got a pattern for two baby blankets last month. There was the hexagon, that pretty pink baby blanket, if you like pink. I'm not that big of a fan of pink. And then also a Sanka blanket with the little diamond shape. Now, the yarn that they sent us, and there was a fupa with the yarn last month. I'm sure many of you remember that. But they sent us this Zima super soft yarn initially they sent us four balls of the blue and then four balls of pink and my understanding was that an error that was an error and so i emailed mary maxim and i know a lot of you did too and what they did is they sent out two additional balls of the pink and two additional balls of the blue at their cost so there was no additional shipping cost to us so i'm not sure that they made much money on last month's mary maxim but you know it was an error. I'm sure somebody got talked to about it. But anyway, so that was what we got. So we ended up with six balls blue, six balls pink. And I have some of the blue left over. And this is pretty much all I have left over from the pink. So two blankets is what we were supposed to make. I did make one of the blankets. And so let me show you that. And I'm going to pop it up on the screen so you can look too in a second. But with the pink, I did go ahead and I made the pink baby blanket so it turned out pretty nice and I did follow the pattern for the most part the edging is what they had this is where I didn't I deviated because it wanted me to do more double crochet and instead I did alternating bobbles there for the last couple of rounds because I thought it looked better the center I really like the center on that I might do this in a different color this one, as I shared before, is going to be donated. I will not keep it. Mine is 32 inches, even though I did deviate. And there, another thing that I did that was different was I didn't do this single strand. No way. With as tiny as that yarn was, I did triple strand for this blanket. And so I held three strands together to do the crochet on this, and I used a size JKL hook. And it turned out quite nice. So that was that one. I said that one, showing it to you, and that one is actually going to be donated. And for the blue yarn, what I did, there was a blanket for that too. I didn't make a blanket. What I did is I changed the shape, and actually I'm making it as a runner, and this desk that, that's right beside me, the computer desk that's just beside me, that's where it's gonna live. I made it into a long runner, to go over this computer desk because this room in here is kind of a greenish blue and it looks really good up against the wall as you can see yeah so that's where it's going to go um, but this is what the runner looks like and you can see this is one of the designs that i did and in the middle hopefully you can see that is like the diamond shape and then at the bottom i did another design that mirrored the one on top and so I did three designs on it, just different designs than what they did. And like I say, the top and bottom. This one kind of made me think of like a flower, and so that's why I did that, and then a diamond. This turned out to be about 60 inches long, and it's 15 inches wide, which is pretty much perfect for what I want to use it for on here. 
Okay, so that was last month's. I still have some blue yarn left over um, that I'll use somewhere else. But out of the two projects, one I'll keep, one I'm going to give away. Um, here, I'm going to make you dizzy there. Okay, so let's move on. So now we have October's. Um, and let's get to this one. Let's see what we got. This one is not as big as last month, guys. So let me feel. Um, I feel, I think I feel a couple of cakes and then a couple of skeins. I could be wrong. That's what I feel like. It is much lighter than the last one. So let's get in here and see what we got. And for those who are not aware, and I show many of you are at this point, the first month for Mary Max and Crochet Kit month of, of the month is $9.99 plus $4.99 shipping. And every month thereafter that is $14.99. So, and they reduced the shipping recently. And so now I'm all in for $19.98. And we'll verify that in a second. Um, but that's what it cost me. And for me, Mary Maxim is my favorite because of the variant on the patterns. Even if I don't use the patterns, it gives me good ideas of things I want to make. Ooh, boy, that's a pretty yarn so far. And so it gives me good ideas of stuff I want to make. And so for me, it's a good value. It keeps me busy for a couple weeks, which I'm happy with. Same price. Yep, $19.98. Crochet kit of the month. Let's see what we got. I'm very excited. Let me get my computer rolling again because as I shared, if we have time, I'll look up the prices of the yarn. Okay, let's see what we got. Oh my goodness, that's pretty. Ooh, I might make that. I don't know if it's going to go. They're saying it's a wrap or a scarf. It looks, look guys, here it is. Look at those colors. Move back so you can see it a little bit. Oh my gosh, that's pretty. And it says it's a 13 by 80. Probably wouldn't be for me. Worsted weight, maypole, DK. Should be four balls using a 5.5 hook. Um, it looks like a two row repeater. And so if you guys get this, look at it on her guys. Look at that. That is pretty. Let's look at the yarn. I got four balls. Let me fix this. Maple DK. Look at that color. Let's dig in there a little bit. We got blues, oranges, there's some yellow over there. Look, as it matches kind of like my shirt is so colorful today, and this yarn is very colorful. Let's look at it. Made in China. It's not super soft. It's called Hot Rose. If they're saying it's Euro Baby. It's polyester. That's interesting. Um, it's a polyester yarn. Uh, suggested knitting. It's a four. And they're saying the crochet gauge is 5.5, which is what this pattern is calling for. I'm looking for the washing instructions here. I am not seeing it. it just says made in China. Oh, there it is. Washing, lie flat to dry. And it's 262 yards, and we get four balls. And it looks like mine actually matches the pattern that's on the page. I'm, Seems to me I've heard of this before. So that looks like the pattern for this month, guys. It's going to be a wrap or, they're saying it's going to be a wrap or a thing here. Um, let's see. DK from Knitting Fever is where I'm looking. And at that place, Oh, they're making, oh, look at all those colors. There's tons of colors for this, this type of yarn, guys. 264, I am not seeing a price real quick, so which means I will put it up above because I don't want to keep you guys forever. Oh, originally $8 a scheme. They were doing a closeout sale on some of the colors, and so it's $8 a scheme um, original. So 
for full price for regular price of these it's eight dollars so sixteen thirty two dollars plus the pattern we're in there again guys because we paid 20 and so if we do eight sixteen thirty two plus the pattern three to five dollars we're at 35 fantastic yeah i will probably be making this i'm curious to see how this washes up if it's going to soften up it's not like terribly rough um, but it's not the softest polyester i felt but anyway that's the pattern for this time and that my friends is the beautiful yarn okay guys i will chat with you next time happy crocheting and i'll see you again bye